Dave the Family Farmer here, and guess what I got for you today? You ain't gonna believe how I'm doing this. I'm going, I am doing my red wigglers, mind you, not night crawlers, but red wigglers, and I'm gonna feed them all natural on an all natural diet, just like they do in the wild. Okay? And I've been experimenting on this and talking with other worm people, and, uh, so far it's working. So anyway, I got my big red bucket here. I went down the basement. And of course I did the same thing as I did with my night crawlers. Basically, I uh, put in peat moss, a lot of leaf molds, you know, see how the leaves are nice and uh, and actually this uh, my material is nice and moist. I have grass clippings. Uh, the majority of this is peat moss. Uh, the rest of it, whole leaves, crunched up leaves, straw, grass, dried up grass clippings, and all that stuff, all mixed together, and I got it all nice and moist. So I went down the stairs. And I was going through my uh, worm casting because I'm starting some more buckets for my red wigglers. And uh, of course, I went down there and I scooped some out. And uh, I brought up some worm castings. I want to show you the worm casting for my red wigglers. There's These are the castings of the red wigglers, and of course, there is some uh, eggs in there. Look at that stuff. That is, that is some of the best worm castings I've seen. And of course, there's some eggs in there. I've been suffering. There's C right there. Well, I don't see them in there, but anyways, see right there. So, I just grabbed a couple handfuls of uh, red wigglers, and I'm going to dump them right in here. See them? And they're going right, they're going right in the pot. These are some nice, these are some nice, nice, these are some nice worms. Look at these. You ain't going to find anything nicer than that. Lively, I'm telling you. Look at these. And I'm going to put them in here. These castings are going in here because there's uh, young ones in here too. And, uh, Are these some nice worms? Yes, they are looking at them. Oh, you better believe it. So anyway, as you can see, they're going right here in the my bucket here. Yeah, look at that. Nice, nice big old fat ones. Skinny ones. Yeah. They're gonna love their new home. I believe that uh yeah, look at the look at the size of this. And these were all on a natural diet. These here. That's why I'm putting them back in an all natural diet, to where I don't have to feed them corn on the cob, and garbage, and uh, refuse, you know, that kind of stuff. And I'm an all natural guy here. I like to uh, try that. I don't know what. There's got to be a couple. Look at that. Is that a nice worm? Am I the only guy that gets this excited over worms? I don't know. I don't know about you, but I do. And so now I'm just going to see how these do. 
and they seem to be they're starting to burrow down in there yeah I can't believe how nice and lively these are uh, there's a youngster two youngsters in there I don't know if you can if you want to come over here with the camera duty but, uh, take a look in there see in there look at how nice these are see how they're starting to and I shouldn't have to add any material in here for quite a while because they're going to eat through this like crazy look at that happy home you guys Boys and girls, whatever you want to call yourselves. Oh. And I'm just going to cover them up with this straw. And they're going to live on an all natural diet. Let me tell you, I'm going to have some worm casting that can't be beat right here in this, this tub. So, people, here it is. You saw it here. Red Wigglers on an all-natural diet. Yes, you can do it. If I can do it, you can do it, guys. You know, take care now. God bless. Subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button if you think this is good. Leave me a comment. Hey, we'll talk to you later. Y'all take care. Bye-bye.